In Athens recently, the University of Georgia hosted a women's only ag training class. Those who attended the event received hands-on instruction on a variety of different topics around the farm. Damon Jones was at the event and has the story. In the fields or just around the household, women play a vital role in farming operations all across the country. That's why it's so important for those not involved on a day-to-day -day basis to learn some of the basic skills. It's the reason this women's only training session hosted by UGA Extension is so significant as it gives them hands-on experience. We're trying to keep the groups very small. We have a limited number of participants, um, specifically so that every participant has the chance to drive a tractor, to hook and pull a trailer, to um, put up fencing, calibrate sprayers, things that are things that are normal everyday experiences on the farm. And as you can see, it's truly a women's only event, including the instructors who all have years of experience in the field, but can still relate to those in attendance. Our teachers are all extension agents, ag agents within their county. Um, we all come from a farm background. We all understand the challenges that women face today on the farm. So we want to bring them out and give them a chance to experience possibly some new things in a stress-free environment. And that type of setting helps put the participants more at ease, which means they are likely to ask more questions. I think a women's only event is great. Some of the comments that we have gotten back is that they feel much more comfortable talking with women. They don't feel nearly as intimidated as, as they might be from men who have been in the industry for years and years and they aren't afraid to ask another woman a question that they might feel intimidated about asking a, a, a man who has been working in the industry for a long time. While some of these women don't work in the field all the time, it's still very important that they know how to do some of the daily tasks. Even if you don't work on the farm every day, you may be the only one home and your cows get out and you have to put them back in and fix the fence. You may have to crank the tractor to put in a bale of hay and that's not something you're extremely familiar with. So this is just helping them get familiar with different types of um, tractors, possibilities for fixing fence, hooking up to trailers, um, even calibrating sprayers. And with that understanding, it's easier to share experiences and spread the story of agriculture to those in the community. It's important for women to know what's going on on a daily basis on the farm, whether they work on the farm as a career or not, whether they work off the farm, they're able to communicate with others about it. And today it's more important than ever to be able to communicate what we do on farms to the general public. And if these instructors could pick one thing they want these women to take away from this event. Confidence in their ability to attempt new things um, when they go home on the farm. If they need to pitch in and help, then they say, yes, I can do this. Ideally, I hope that they can go home saying that they've learned something, that they maybe feel a little more confident. I really don't think there is any substitute at all for actually doing something rather than, than watching it done or seeing a presentation about it being done. I really hope that, that somebody can go home and say, I learned this because I was able to do this. Reporting from Athens, I'm Damon Jones for the Georgia Farm Monitor.